Good afternoon, Clay Thompson here at Guarantee RV Center. Today I'm going to show you a brand new, just showed up from the factory, 2019 Eclipse Attitude 35 GSG. Come on inside, let me show you this great looking toy hauler. First off, I want to mention something about Eclipse. They are built in Southern California. Um, they build toy haulers exclusively. So all they make is toy haulers. So they really know their stuff when it comes to building these things for the fun toys that we like to play with. Side-by-sides, quads, what have you. Uh, so anyways, as we go down through this unit, uh, notice the large bank of uh, cabinets we have over above the seating area. Nice big windows. This has got uh, almost 14 and a half feet from the rear door to the counter area here. And then uh, we narrow up here, we got about 19 and a half feet here uh, with the tie down. So if we got a small little quad or maybe a motorcycle, we can get up into here. Um, cabinets throughout, all the way down. Dimmer switch inside for the kitchen area on the lighting. Um, Uh, nice big uh, windows like I mentioned with the recessed lighting over and above and around. Super nice comfortable freestanding chairs that can be moved outside underneath the patio uh, awning or out on the patio out the back end. As we turn around back there I'll show you some more of that. Plenty of D-rings in the floor. Um, so you can tie your machines down in any configuration that fits for you. This has the bunk bed, individual lighting above for the bunk area with nice big windows, and what they call the pass-through dinette or opposing dinette here that when we don't have the tables or if we just have one table set up, we can pass through out to the patio. And then this bed will go up out of the way and be up oh, about yay tall up here out of the way so um, we can easily walk through. It's got the toolbox built in the bottom here in the back end for uh, what have you. Heavy patio capacity back here. Does have the gate kit as well uh, for the small kids, small dogs, whatever. Um, or we can remove it to make it easier to load things in and out. Got the new uh, what I call the petrol resistant and or even as far as permanent marker resistant flooring. That's nice. Got the large screen Jensen stereo system. You got a TV there. Got a TV up front. Got a TV outside and we have a space for another TV in the bedroom uh, uh, for the other TV. Another thing I wanted to show you here on the cabinetry, when they build these walls, these are aluminum framed wall, uh, insulated throughout with metal backing. This is a magnet. So I got metal backing that is in the wall to help secure the cabinetry to the wall. Um, you know, I guess I would just challenge uh, if you're interested in strength and integrity of what you're buying. Might be a little test you might throw out there on some of the other product out there in comparison. This is a nice big slide out here. So we have the couch that folds up and or couch by day. Um, the kitchen, the whole kitchen slides out. So when it comes in, it'll come into about, oh, about yay far. Still wide enough for most side by sides to fit in between. Large four-door refrigerator and freezer. Big pantry, pull-out pantry there with the ball bearing rollers. Hold quite a bit of stuff there with the nice clear-cut plywood as you notice. Big three-burner cooktop. Big oven. Residential size, this one's got the microwave. There is an option for convection if need be. Nice countertop area, all LED backlit, drawers and cabinets inside. This one's got the new, what I call the, um, the basin sink instead of the two small little sinks that you can't put a pan in. Another big screen TV here, 
Jensen stereo system here that plays all your audio stuff throughout and your DVDs as well as being Bluetooth. Fuse panel here, gen switch in here. This one has the upgraded stereo system so it's got the kicker uh, amplifiers. HDMI splitter for your TVs. More cabinets throughout. Tons of space. They just utilize every little space that they can. The monitor station here that uh, controls and where we can control is right here. Um, with slide out motors, um, power awning, the uh, hot water heater system, dimmer switch for your kitchen area, exterior lighting, uh, tank control, or uh, tank capacities there. Walk up into this, this is a side out bathroom. So we got a nice big bathroom here with the corner glass shower area here for towels and washcloths and whatnot you may need in the bathroom fan skylight in the shower porcelain toilet and it's passed through into the bedroom this particular model is king size bed we got storage up underneath the bed there too Windows on each side for uh, ventilation. Second air conditioner. This one's got solar as well. Big closet. With four doors. Do we have some more storage space here with shelving? Recessed lighting in the window area. Tons of cabinet space. And another area for another TV that's pre-wired, pre-cabled for a bedroom TV as well. This is going to have the power awning outside, LED strip for the door light with an LED light strip underneath the awning. Notice how thick this floor is, very sturdy floor, um, thicker than most. That's one thing, again, you might test with some of the other guys out there, uh, the thickness of the floor. High gloss gel coat. Exterior patio TV with sound bar. And you'll notice that these TVs are made for uh, mobility. So it is made to bounce a little bit and absorb a, a little bit of shock. Um, it's not a TV made to sit on a counter spot in the house that never gets moved. So made for an RV. Big 16 inch tire and wheel. Zerk fittings on all the movable suspension so we can grease it ourselves at home. We don't have to take it in for that service. Six point auto leveling system that's electric, not hydraulic. So we have uh, manual uh, uh, crank up uh, if need be. We'll never be stranded because we got a broken hydraulic line. All has backup system. Large windows. The rear patio deck's about eight feet for extra space. And then when it goes up, it just walks up. Built-in lock system on the back door. Sprung load across the bottom. Spare tire up underneath. Reflectorized graphics on the back end along with the reflectorized tail lights for safety. You never know if your plug comes undone on the truck and the guy behind you doesn't see you until he runs into the back of you. So the reflector he can see at night. 12 volt pump station. Mounted ladder that uh, retracts is always with us. So we have accessibility up to the roof. It is a walk on roof, plywood in the floors, plywood in the roof. This one has the dual fuel cells, so one runs generator separate, as well as the fuel station. Um, this has the uh, uh, inverter system on there too, so we can actually watch our TVs inside and out without running the generator, which is a nice feature. This is a triple axle. Uh, and it's less than 40 feet. 
Most of the units that you'll find out there are a triple axle because they're over 40 feet. When you look at the carrying capacity on this, it is huge for the size trailer that it is. Pop up here, our gate valves are up in the heated and closed underbelly area. All plastic line in the interior here, so if it does get some moisture, it's not going to mold carpet or rot wood. Um, lit, heated, enclosed there. Battery disconnect inside here. Uh, this one has the uh, 5500 Onan generator, enough to run both ACs if need be. Bedroom slide out. Very solid, good all season coach, sealed and protected underbelly. One piece end cap with the LED lights. Another system here I'd like to show so you get an idea. Right here you can see how thick that floor is and how thick the linole on the floor is, commercial grade. So I mean, it is built a little more rugged than what you're going to see in just about all the other products out there. Uh, good solid product. We sell more attitudes by Eclipse in our toy hauler lineup than just about anything else that we got. So a uh, very popular toy hauler brand. Um, very glad to have it. It's got the cut end cap so it will turn 88 degrees if you got a short bed truck and no slider hitch. I do recommend if you're getting off road though, uh, you might want to consider that slider hitch just for those tight spots because we know we all get into them. The other side of the basement area here, heated and lit. This has the optional central vac system as well. So kind of in a nutshell that wraps it up on this one. Uh, this one weighs just 12,940 pounds. It's specifically weighed as it comes offline with the equipment that's in it. So it comes offline at 12,940 and this unit will handle um, up to 560 pounds of capacity. That's huge when you're looking at some of that other product out there. So they take that in consideration when they build it because they know that our toys get a little bit heavier. Uh, any further questions on any of the toy hauler products that we carry, as well as the attitudes, uh, be happy to help. Clay Thompson here at Guarantee RV Center. Uh, reach me direct at 541-979-1770. And we can talk about what your needs and your wants are, and we'll see if we can't find you one. Thanks and have a great day.